let's just wrap up on one last thing. I mean, now we've done ears, but well, we've done eyes and mouth. So mm -hmm. kids that have had tubes in their ears, mm -hmm. okay? Kids that have tubes in their ears can't swallow. That's why they can't clear their digestional tubes. Mm. So if they have a swallowing issue, that's why it keeps building up fluid. Yeah. So, Interesting. Yeah. So. So wait, you're you're gonna have to unpack that a little bit okay, because sorry. this is so if if someone has eustachian tube dysfunction, so, how does that relate to the swallow? So are you saying that? So normally, what happens, right? So swallowing, and again, I am not 100%, but like it's the idea, the concept of the swallowing is what helps clear it. Like it helps the fluid run through. Yeah. So if-, if Because it has attachments into the- Yeah, yeah, ear, nose, throat. Trick, I, think, yeah. I think that's why they're ENTs. No, um, mm. So- you down, you down with the ENT? Uh, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> so the concept of like, if you can't swallow, like, so if, you're, if your tongue's low, mm -hmm. so swallowing for anyone who doesn't know, right? So tongue should be up. You should be able to swallow with minimal facial movement. Yeah. Tongue should just go up down up very easy right so it kind of scoops it back is that it's how you're like, approaching a swallow or it's yeah. almost like a whip too, yeah like, yeah whip's good yeah it's like but the idea is like i i drink it's actually suction kind of back right it should mm. have like a natural sliding mm, back okay. to it yeah 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 you know kind of in a way something along those lines but minimal movement of the of the face mm -hmm. so the idea is like swallowing should not be exciting to see because you shouldn't see it you know mm -hmm. something silly like that and the truth is when that doesn't happen and you and you had to work multiple swallows like this is where chewing and right bulbous preparation um people that have to <clears throat> multiple swallows yeah. always have a drink while they're eating because they need assistance when they have to swallow their food when all that comes into play well when they're little if there was a true issue with the way they were swallowing it doesn't clear everything right so you know they're more prone to get ear infections or now the tubing you know tubes are in and then the tubes came out and we had to re-put them in mm. so and i and again I, i'm sure ents will come back and be like, well there's so much more to it and i, I absolutely i am sure. not giving it near all the justice it it deserves i'm just saying so when i'm going through and i'm looking at somebody who's had tubes twice Mm -hmm. They've had multiple ear infections. They have tonsils that are pretty enlarged. Mm -hmm. They have an elongated face. Their teeth are crowded. I mean, like how many things? Like, there's enough there to show. Like there's something bigger going on here. Yeah. And and those are my other things. My other things like if you had your, if your tonsils and adenoids were taken out when you were really young, I'm always like, why? Mm -hmm. What created the tonsils and adenoids to be so large? I just want to know why. Like that's what, right. So yeah. Is that maybe because they were breathing with their mouth a little bit more and the tonsils and adenoids? are a secondary mm -hmm. filtration system. It's a backup because they didn't nasal breathe as much as they were supposed to. Mm -hmm. So it kept the tonsil adenoids constantly enlarged and created a lot of pressure in the back of the throat. So of course we took them out and everything got better, but then we didn't address the fact that they really never learned how to breathe with their nose. We just took it away and now they just continue to mouth breathe. Yeah. Now they don't even have any filter. Yeah. I, I don't know, I assume that the saying you have no filter in your mouth came from that <laughs> interesting yeah i don't wow. know i i always thought that i kind of like it i mean that yeah you have no filter so i yeah. always walk around and i have no filter because <laughs> you had your tonsils no i just around. have no filter oh, <laughs> <enough>. <laughs> no i actually have but my then tonsils. if you did get them taken out so, but here really i no had filter. tonsillitis like nine times really and i was like why i asked my mom why didn't you take them out and I'm, i don't think she wanted to tell me but she, they probably did <laughs> and i guess lucky for me my mom didn't make it to that appointment <laughs> I don't know, but I, wow. I, I tonsillitis. I only reason I remember that. I remember one summer, I was in bed for like six weeks, and I remember like listening to all the kids play outside. And I mean, I would get Dang. and till this day, yeah. if I've been like traveling a lot and doing things, I'm definitely first thing that goes my voice. Mm. <clears throat> and it'll dry and I'll get a sore throat. I was always that kid, so I did have those issues, mm -hmm. and I grind the te you know I was grinding my teeth like there was no tomorrow. Yeah, but I never had braces. Wow. Because why? Because my tongue was plastered up there. I had to have a decent shape. Because mm -hmm. I don't know where, like, it was right there. But I didn't grow forward because I was mm -hmm. keeping everything like this. 